So now I'm going to go over the study summary, which has to do with the pace at which bone integrates into the prosthetic. Okay, and I've provided you a little table here. It's got time, bone in prosthetic, and then the percentage of total. So for example, if you look at the three month line, that is 10% bone found in the prosthetic at three months post-op, and that 10% represents 38% of the total. So the total is 26% bone in the prosthetic. Obviously it can't be 100% because it's mostly made of titanium. So with that porous surface though, they found that there was a total of 26% bone integrated into the porous surface of the titanium implant. So that third column kind of tells you what your progress is, right? So if I've got 10% bone in there, but I'm gonna ultimately have 26%, then 10% represents 38% of that total. So as you can see, looking at the numbers, at three months post-op, you're only 38% of the way to complete osseointegration. At six months, you're only 58% of the way. So that's just a little bit past halfway. Now at nine months, you're at 100%. So if you can manage things appropriately and not mess up your prosthetic, then you'll have complete solid integration at nine months post-op, give or take. Now, of course, this can vary a lot depending on individual circumstances, bone quality, age, other comorbidities, things like that.